Galaxy midfielder, number eight, Steven Gerrard. Thank you very much for a fantastic welcome. Uh, and thanks very much for making myself and my family feel at home here in LA. It feels, it, it feels great to be here. Uh, I'm excited and I can't wait to get my boots on and play in front of you guys and hopefully, hopefully we can have some good times together and it can be a successful future. Happy 4th of July, all the best. As you can imagine, his name uh, is going to be massive uh, for the development of, of the league. But not only the name and, and the marketing side of it, the game. What he can bring is, you know, his, his desire, his commitment, his vision, his professionalism. Uh, you will see, he wants to win. And he, he go, that goes along with your, with your team. Obviously, as you can imagine, we, we tried to win a, a title, but you guys were always in the way, uh, even way before that we actually could meet you uh, anywhere near the final. Stevie G can, can bring a lot of stuff in the game that sometimes the fans need to understand. The game isn't only about bicycle kick and scoring a screamer and nutmegs and step overs. That's not only the game. Stevie G can give you a, a little idea of what the game is sometimes. Covering, seeing a pass, to stop a pass. I mean, diagonal ball, good vision, his commitment, good, good professionalism, stuff that sometimes fans don't kind of see. at that very young age, my dad used to dr drill it into me every single day. Every time you put the shirt on, when you've got the badge on your chest, you've got to give everything. You get out of football what you put in. Um, we used to get the opportunity to train twice a week for one hour. You guys can train every day. You have the opportunity to impress Chris, Bruce, your own staff every single day. And that's a very lucky position to be in because I had two hours a week and that wasn't enough, I wanted more. These have got unbelievable facilities in the school. For me, education's important as well. You know, it's, it's, it's a cruel thing to say, but not everyone who tries to be a professional footballer makes it. So it's important that you concentrate and give everything in your schoolwork as well, because if it doesn't happen, you've got something healthy to fall back on. So my advice is don't ever let one training session or one bit of advice or one bit of coaching go. You know, you know make, make Give everything you've got from now. Don't wait till a certain age. You know, start from now. You know, every session is important. Thanks much for joining us. I know it's been a hectic whirlwind of a, a week for you. How's it been so far? Yeah, it's been fantastic. Um, you know, the people of LA have made me feel so welcome, myself and my family, and I'm really excited. Uh, I just wish I could play tonight. You know, the, the first game can't come quick enough. Um, I'm really looking forward to, you know, a successful future. and. Uh, yeah, I'm happy. I know you had a chance to train with the guys, meet the team, meet Bruce. What was that like? Well, Bruce and the players and, and the rest of the staff have made me feel very welcome. Uh, already I'm starting to feel settled and yeah, I'm looking forward to playing with the guys. You know, we've already got a good team here, full of, full of good players. So if I can add a little bit to that, I think the future is going to be good. I know it's a big transition not only for you but having your family here in a new country. Did you get any advice from Robbie Keane and David Beckham on how they were able to do it? Yeah, I got a lot of advice from both players. Uh, this is a big change and a new challenge for me and my family. I've been in Liverpool all my life, but you know this is a good place for me to come and enjoy my football and hopefully add some trophies to my collection.